it's going to explain a little bit about uh, why overstroke breaks things in the Titman. So this is your valve body, right? So valve body, this is your linkage, and this is your air nozzle, yeah? This is your hammer. So while it's in the Titman, there's a slot, right, that the linkage goes into. The forward movement is actually stopped by the valve body. So it can only move that much forward, yeah? Uh, where overstroke comes into play is when it moves to the rear. Sorry about that. So, so this would be cocked, right? The hammer is all the way back. When a hammer is all the way back, the only thing holding the hammer in place is this linkage. That's why um, you'll start to see this linkage get damaged over here in the front will start to get damaged and this pin will start hitting the charge handle so when you're overstroke you're letting it go too far and this pin starts hitting crap uh, and it also puts a lot of pressure on the linkage and it damages the air nozzle too so what you want to do is you want to limit overstroke you want it to go to um, basically you don't want to go too far Man. So what short stroke means is where this latch point is on the hammer, I've cut it back. Uh, what this does, it does two things. You can shim, you can limit how much of a stroke this uh, assembly actually has. It's not by much, you're actually not limiting it by much. But what you are doing is that you're giving the sear more time to latch onto the hammer. Uh, so this makes the rate of fire, if you're running a high rate of fire, it makes it a lot more stable. Uh, because the, the sear can catch it. Um, it's like you're giving it a little bit more duration or more time for the sear to come up and catch the hammer. Uh, also while doing short stroke, um, you're giving the sear more time, but you're also keeping it within its range of motion. You're not overextending it uh, to give it more time. So that's actually one of the big benefits of um, short stroking is that you're keeping it within its spec, within its, its range of motion, and you're giving the sear more time to latch the hammer.